I started by studying computer science because in the early 80s it seemed like a good thing to do a growing industry and in, th in doing so I got into computer graphics so basically creating pictures with computers and then moved on to doing some scientific visualization work actually using supercomputer calculations turning little videos into it sort of scientific and structural material and then really moved to, from America to mental images in Berlin where I worked for about a year and a half and really my big start into movies was when I joined Industrial Light and Magic in 1990 to work on Terminator 2. It was a big expansion for the company in terms of their computer graphics. They had done The Abyss before so computer you know were much more becoming more important and Terminator 2 really relied on the poly alloy the villain to be a computer generated character so that was my break so to speak into film work for Hollywood. A lot has changed in 10 years. I mean, essentially it's been 10 years. We worked on Perfect Storm in 1999. Um, I think water is still a challenge. There are still only a very few companies who can do it really, really well. But overall, technology has advanced so much. I mean, compute power just in these 10 years has, I don't know what the factor is, but it's gotten incredibly less expensive. The software has really matured. A lot of things that we were still inventing are now basic plugins and in, in software packages to be available. And yet I think the leaders in all technologies, we're talking about you know, whether you're doing facial recreation as they did in the curious case of Benjamin Button, and you know, water probably as you see in 2012, that is still kind of custom software. That the, you know, the most advanced companies are still pushing the envelope, and yet there's a lot of off-the-shelf software that already does quite a bit more things than we had at our hands uh, 10 years ago. There's some technical challenges left or creative challenges left in, you know, creating a, the digital human, I'm sure we're going to, or, you know, sort of a, a different digital character persona. We saw some of that, you know, very successfully in Lord of the Rings with Gollum. Benjamin Button, I think, was on a more human level, very, very successful in the aging of, of Brad Pitt. And then Avatar is going to be interesting as well. So there, I think there's still, there, I think there's still overall the, the challenge of breathing life into a computer generated character in the photorealistic setting. If you look on the other side where Pixar is working and you know, CG animation is going, I mean they do that incredibly well. But they're not trying to fool us that we're looking at real humans either. So there's a distinction there. I think it's, you know, I think to understand the process as a whole, it's, it's very important to, if, if for, you know, for a cinematographer, for instance, to understand what we do and what we will do afterwards, we'll just, it's, it's just knowing information, awareness. It's sort of the concept of awareness of what other people bring to the finished product. And I think it's, it's you know, it's, it's not to be underestimated how each person's, how each of the different people working on a film, uh, the keys, you know, the cinematography, sound, editing, what they all contribute. So the more we know about what each other do, I think the more it helps us to come up with a product in the end that seems truly integrated. That's why I like the festival so much because a lot of conferences I've attended are just entirely focused on visual effects. And I think here it's fantastic that you're bringing together editors, uh, cameramen, cinematographers, and people from dis different disciplines to talk about their craft. And just even to meet those people and chat a little bit about, I mean, obviously I know this work very well because I watch a lot of films and I'm sort of up on the what happens in the industry but I think it's fantastic to kind of uh, let the different disciplines of filmmaking intermingle in this fashion.